the reproductive part. I have already drawn this diagram because it is the video which I have to make in 5 minutes, 4 minutes. So, in the view of short of time, so I have already drawn the picture uh, diagram of flower. This is flower is known as the reproductive part in flower. Flower is also known as modified modified shoot modified shoot so we will discuss here the parts of flower one by one first this is the receptacle from which all the worlds are attached to this part this known as the receptacle and after that this is known as the sepal sepal is it is a protective part of flower which gives the protection to the whole flower upper part of this flower and they also play role in the photosynthesis 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 in making the food for the pl uh, plant so they sepals play in role in photosynthesis and al also as a protective part of in flower sepals after that uh, there is a petal which is usually colored in color why colored in color because colored in color because they attract the insects insects for pollination pollination uh, in flower done by many methods there are various methods one is the insects they also play a role in the pollination by these uh, petals insects are get attracted towards the flower and they play a role in pollination of flower after that there is a uh, male reproductive part of flower known as the stamen. Stamen consists of anther and stigma. Sorry, anther and filament. This is the stamen male part of flower. This is anther and this is this part is filament. Whole known as stamen. These both consists of stamen. Male part of flower. Male reproductive part of flower. After that, this is the female. This one female reproductive part of flower upper is stigma and this is style which I have mentioned here and this is the ovary ovary of flower I have written here stamen consists of anther and filament and stig uh, pistil consists of stig stigma style ovary these are uh, anther these uh, they pollen greens they fall on this stigma and they uh, move towards the ovary through this style of uh, female part of uh, uh, reproductive part of flower and the fertilization occurs so this whole is known as uh, female reproductive part of flower and this is male reproductive part of flower now flower they are both two kinds flowers are two types one is complete complete flower complete flower another is incomplete flower incomplete flower flower here i will give the example for example complete flower is jenna rose jenna rose this flower is complete because all the worlds are present in this jenna rose flower so it is a complete flower and this is the incomplete flower incomplete flower in which some worlds are absent this example of incomplete flower is cooker betis cooker betis is the example of incomplete flower and one is more one hermaphrodite or bisexual flower in which both the male and female part are present known as the hermaphrodite or bisexual flower unisexual flower is in which the only one part is present known as the unisexual flower and one is in the flower where the only stamen male part is present known as staminate flower staminate flower and another another in which the female part is known as pistillate flower so this is all about the flower thank you very much